Luxury. Elegance. German engineer. Are you jealous yet? Hi, I am Shane with the Drum Center of Portsmouth in Portsmouth, New Hampshire. We are on the web at drumcenternh.com, and today we are doing a dream drum set showcase. We had the idea of, hey, let's uh, grab three of the best looking, most expensive drum sets we have in the store and do a video comparing the three. Wow, that sounds like a terrible idea, huh? One of the things we wanted to do too was have three different drum shells all together. We decided that we were gonna narrow it down to three. We were gonna have a maple kit, a mahogany kit, and a beach kit. And so today, it's gonna be DW Collector Series, which will be maple, the Thomas Star mahogany, and we will use the Sonar Heavy Beach. The symbols we're featuring today are very dreamy. We've got Peisty Signature Traditional Crashes, Signature Dark Energy Ride, and then we have the 602 Modern Essentials 15-inch Hi-Hats, my favorite Hi-Hats. The DW Collector Series Private Reserve. This is a gorgeous set of drums. This has a candy burst over Moabi wood. This is an HVLT shell, which is one of the many variations that DW offers with their shells. The HVLT shell is basically another result of DW's endless pursuit to find the lowest fundamental note out of a drum shell. And uh, they do that very well. And this has no re-rings on the shell, so it's just a straight wall shell, which is something I like. It has nickel hardware, which is gorgeous. And it really shows off what DW is capable of doing with their finishes and exotic woods. It's really just remarkable. And I know there's a lot of people there be like, well, you know, I can go out and play a gig on my $500 drum set and I don't need all that. Well, that's fine, but there are people out there that do want this. And when it comes to offering exotic veneers, specialty finishes, I don't think that there's really anybody that can touch what DW does. <laughs> I mean, they really have a lot going on with that.
It's no secret that I am a huge admirer of the Tama Star Series drums. When it comes to top level quality craftsmanship design, you name it, the Star Series ticks all those boxes. They are just absolutely fantastic, well-made, some of the best sounding drums I've ever played. And they have the maple and the babinga and the walnut. And for a very limited time, they have done a star mahogany kit. And what's even more limited is the Midnight Storm Sapeliwood star mahogany, which is something that's exclusive to us. When Tama came up with the Star Series drums, it was basically, as the story was told to me, that they were looking to create the best sounding set of drums that anybody had ever heard, and they didn't care what it cost. And when I first played the Maples and the Babingas, I knew right away that these were incredibly special drums and they were certainly the best sounding Tama drums I'd ever played. The Mahoganys, they have this nice, round, fat sound, but they also have a pronounced attack, which is something I'm really having a lot of fun with as I play these toms. The kick is just how I like it, nice and thumpy. And the snare drum has more bottom end than I know what to do with, which is just so elusive in snare drums, especially ones like this. And I gotta tell you, the kit's making me really happy. To me, the Sonar SQ2 is the dream kit. I have a, a, just a big place in my heart for their drums. I think they're wonderful. This is the Heavy Beach kit with an African marble veneer. And that veneer is inside and outside. Sonar is one of the very few companies that offer the matching interior veneer as an option. The SQ2 is one of the most customizable drum lines on the market today. And on this kit, they include the DTH-653, or as we like to call it, the rocket launcher mount, which is optional. You don't have to get this mount, 
But what's great about it, to me, I, I love it. It's a very, it's a very polarizing mind. People either love it or they hate it. I think it's a marvelous piece of engineering because on my kit, positioning is so easy. I could get a slightly deeper rack tom positioned very easily, better than I could with any other mount. And the plus side of this is that it doesn't even penetrate the shell. So if we pull this mount off the drum, it's as if it was never even there. I also found that my bass drum sound got a little more compressed and focused with it and improved things from a recording and live standpoint. But if you don't like it, that's cool too. The benefit is that it's truly customizable and you can have it the way you'd like it. There are a lot of companies that do a lot of custom options and that's great, but what really gets me time and again with Sonar Drums is the shell. Nobody makes a shell like they do, so no other drum is going to sound like a Sonar. Their shells are slightly undersized by about 12 millimeter, and it allows the head to float on the shell so that it creates a tympanic effect. And it, it sounds beautiful and it feels great too, especially when I'm hitting rim shots on the toms. Sonar was one of the very first drum companies to get into metal to wood isolation and it has evolved to what it is now with the current APS system that they have with their lugs and the mounts. All the metal that is going into the shell is heavily gasketed to provide isolation. And as a nice little Art Deco touch, if you look at the Sonar logo with the twin mallets, they are incorporated all over the entire set. You'll notice it on the lugs on the mounting system, the spurs, the floor tom brackets, even the floor tom legs. You see the mallet logo everywhere. It's a nice little understated touch. It's really important to know that today's video was focusing on the, the dream drum set, but 
Your dream drum set may not cost this much. Your dream drum set might cost $800 or $400 or $1,500. So if you need help putting your dream kit together, regardless of the cost, that's what we're here for. So give us a call, send us an email, or order it online. The links to buy all these drum sets and cymbals are going to be in the description below. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can get updated whenever we post new content like this.